Hello everybody and welcome back to the next part of this Minecraft LP and we're going to begin by expanding the um, cave or house, whatever you want to call it and as you can see it's not night yet but it will be or should be during this video at some point so we should be able to go out and kill some monsters just want to finish off this wooden pickaxe because I want to move to stone pickaxes because they last longer and mine quicker. Oop, bit lucky. I'm actually using a different type of software um, now, not Cam Studio anymore because that's just broken completely. I'm using a piece of software called BB Flashback. I will put the link in the description and if I can yeah for the website um, it's free you um, you get a 30 free day trial and if you want the unlimited one you have to register but that is also free the only information you have to give is your email address so they can email you the key code well I'm gonna make a wood stone pickaxe it's just the same as a wooden one but stone at the top funnily enough and the mouse keeps getting stuck. Right, right, there we go. To put our, now we need to put our torches back up. The one there, one there, get rid of that one there, and one up here. Right, now that's done, I want to make some windows here and here. But to make windows, we are going to need some sand. So we're going to go to the beach. Uh, what we need to make glass is um, sand obviously and a furnace we'll switch over again super mouse right and that should be plenty because we only need actually two pieces of sand so there we go got some coal there have to remember that's there so when I need some coal I can come and get it but this episode is not about coal it's about preparing for the monsters that we're going to face right and back in the house we to make our furnace we right click on our workbench and we put one stone in every section except for the middle one right and I also want to make a chest and that's just the same as a furnace in terms of how you make it but instead it's made of wood instead of stone very nice right there's the furnace and there's the chest right so we're going to need two pieces of glass and we're going to need some fuel for the furnace so I'm going to use this wood um, you can use I could use that piece of coal but I only have one piece and I want to save it for later so I'll just use wood because we have quite a bit of it and I'm just putting in the chest the stuff that we won't need for our little expedition outside right that should be done yeah. there's our two pieces of glass one thing about glass is once you've placed it oh like that I can't retrieve it I can see it I just tried to pick it back up and it breaks Oh, that's a stupid thing for me to do, to put it there. Right, I need the glass, the sand back again. Silly me. Right, in you go, you stupid thing. I'm going to create some weaponry. Create three, I'm going to create create three stone swords. So you put the sticks in the bottom, then this is what you do. And there you have. Or there we have. Three nice shiny stone swords oh no I I've got too much glass uh, stupid thing right there thank you let's go in jewelry again which is annoying me like hell right now that that's done 
this mouse will begin to behave itself. We can go on our little hunt for monsters. I can already see a skeleton over there. There are four different types of monsters, obviously skeletons, zombies, spiders and creepers. There's a zombie over there as well, if you can see it. And the skeletons are quite annoying because they have bow and arrows so they can shoot at range, but everything else has to come near you. Right, you see mate? Don't know if you can see those arrows flying, but I don't really want to face a skeleton first. A zombie is an easy target because they have to like come near you and they're slower than the other stuff. No, that's a cow. Hmm. Uh, I'm gonna have to, oh no. The problem is they're like grouped together and I'm gonna die really quickly otherwise. Even though this is on the easy difficulty, it's just so hard fighting these monsters sometimes when they're in big groups. And that, I don't know if you can see it, but it's like jumping down, it looks like a giant green sausage. That's a creeper and it's seen me. Oh, why didn't I move all the way? I was stuck. And as you can see, he's made a massive hole right outside my house. I think I might have to repair that when um, I'm not making a video. Make a nice little pathway or something. But, oh, a zombie see me. No, this is a zombie. And if, if you heard that, that like, noise. And they're the easiest things to kill. And they drop feathers for some reason. I don't know why a zombie would drop feathers. It's not like a chicken, is it? Zombie chickens. Uh, I think we should go after this um, skeleton. But he's gonna, it's gonna hurt because he's gonna be able to hit me. And a cow's in the bloody way. Get out of the way, cow. Oh, you stupid skeleton. I'm gonna probably die. Oh no, I killed him. Already lost half my health and I've only fought three things. But you get arrows from skeletons, but I can't actually use it unless I have a bow. And to make a bow you need wood and string. And to get string you need to kill a spider. So let's see if we can find ourselves a little spider. I see one over there, well I did, because they have glow glowing red eyes. Oh and look, it's another zombie to say hello to us. You won't believe this, but it's actually worse in the caves. I'm being attacked by a skeleton as well. Oh, for God's sake. Right, run, 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 run. As I was saying, it's actually worse in the caves because it's really dark in there. No light at all. And they can be, and you can get lost in caves really easily if they're big cave systems. And they can be hiding in little corners after you and come after you, jump straight out of you. It can be difficult, but um, I'm going to leave this episode here, because it is longer than the first one. But I will make other episodes longer, obviously. So, and I need to heal. <laughs> so, thanks for watching. Um, you've seen what some of the monsters are now, except for spy the spider. We should hopefully see that in the next episode, which I will be making next week, probably. And it will probably be even longer than this one. Um, I'll put a link in the description for that software, recording software, so see you next time.